Today's complication is something called an aplastic crisis. So remember we talked about how your bone marrow produces all of your blood cells and that thing called a reticulocyte was a fancy term for the baby red blood cells produced by your bone marrow. And remember, the faster your sickle cells die, the higher the percentage of baby red blood cells your bone marrow should be creating. Well, an aplastic crisis is not exclusive to sickle cell, but it is something that many people living with sickle cell will experience at some point during a uh, pain crisis. So an aplastic crisis is when your bone marrow in essence just shuts down and stops working. So all of those unhealthy red blood cells are dying, but your bone marrow isn't producing any new ones to fill their spot. This can be fatal if not taken care of quickly because remember those red blood cells are carrying oxygen to all the different parts of your body. So if we have a large amount of them dying and no new ones coming in, then we aren't able to provide oxygen to the body. And without oxygen, our tissues will die and we cannot go on living. So during an aplastic crisis, a, a person living with sickle cell will require a blood transfusion, which is getting packed red blood cells from another donor uh, that has healthy red blood cells. So uh, later on, we will talk about what these transfusions entail because they're much more complicated than a transfusion you or I will get, but they are vital and life-saving to a person living with sickle cells. So I will end today's video by urging all of you to donate blood if you are capable because the, a person living with sickle cell will require a transfusion most likely at some point, if not many times during their life due to complications such as an aplastic crisis. Check us out on the web at hopeforscd.org. Leave any comments or questions below. And if you enjoy what you're seeing, tell your friends and think about signing up for our newsletter. We'll continue our journey through complications for the rest of the week.